monasteries are often located in scenic and secluded areas, away from the distractions of bustling cities and towns, because peace and quiet are essential to an ascetic life. Monks established monasteries in remote and difficult to reach areas to encourage spiritual contemplation and introspection in their search for solitude. Monasteries have beautiful architecture and are often home to impressive artworks, manuscripts, and religious treasures because they were established centuries ago. Furthermore, they each have rich customs, traditions, and religious practices for visitors to explore. This is our pick of 10 such monasteries which are located in the most remote part of the world. Number 10. Dinkar Gampa. Dinkar Gampa is located high in the Himalayas in the far north of India, atop a rocky spur overlooking the fusion of the Spiti and Pin rivers. The Fort Monastery, surrounded by prominent peaks and lunar-like landscapes, is located just above the village of Dinkar, which was once the capital of the Spiti Valley Kingdom. The whitewashed walls of the monastery, which is thought to be over a thousand years old, are home to some lovely courtyards and ceremonial halls, with its beautiful statue of Bhairokana being one of the main highlights. It also has spectacular views of the valley, rivers, and mountains that surround it. Number 9. Debre Damo. Debre Damo is a scenic and secluded spot atop a flat-topped mountain in northern Ethiopia, close to the border with Eritrea. Surprisingly, the monastery can only be reached by scaling a 15-meter-high cliff by pulling yourself up a rope. This makes for an unforgettable experience. The complex itself is equally impressive. Its awe-inspiring Abuna Aragawi church, which dates from the 6th century, is thought to be the country's oldest. Debre Damo, which is still inhabited by monks, is rich in Aksumite architecture, age-old manuscripts, and religious treasures. It is one of the most memorable sites in the Tigray region. Number 8. Samela Monastery. Samela Monastery, perched on a narrow ledge halfway up a steep cliff face in northern Turkey, is nestled away in the Pontic Mountains of northern Anatolia, looking out over the spectacular scenery of the Altındir Valley. The sprawling complex, founded around 386 AD by two Athenian monks, is home to several chapels, a sacred spring, and numerous monk cells. It is dedicated to the Virgin Mary. The unmistakable highlight is its incredible rock-hewn church, which is covered in colorful, centuries-old frescoes. Samela Monastery, which can only be reached by hiking up many long and winding stone steps, is a very important and impressive historical and cultural site that is protected and preserved as a museum by the Turkish government. Number 7. Hanging Monastery. The Hanging Monastery, built into the side of a sheer cliff, appears to be suspended in midair, some 30 meters above ground. The temple, which is located in Shaanxi province, is notable for being the only one in China to combine elements of its three traditional religions, Buddhism, Taoism, and Confucianism. The monastery, which was built more than 1,500 years ago, is an engineering marvel with more than 40 halls and pavilions, as well as fine artworks, sculptures, and architecture scattered throughout. The hanging monastery, protected from the elements in a small canyon basin, looks out over a beautiful gorge, with Mount Hang visible in the distance. Number 6. Ostrog Monastery. Ostrog Monastery, an important and popular pilgrimage site, is located at the top of a steep and winding road in the center of Montenegro. The monastery, which is carved into the cliff face of the large Ostroska Greta rock, was founded by Vasilije in the 17th century and is part of the Serbian Orthodox Church. Many Orthodox, Catholic, and Muslim pilgrims pray here in the hope that their ailments will be healed because its fantastic fresco-coated cave church houses St. Basil of Ostrog's relics. Aside from the wonderful artworks and architecture, Ostrog Monastery also has stunning views of the Bjelaplavlici Plain. Number 5. St. George Monastery. St. George Monastery is located on the islet of Ostrovo Sveti Dord, just off the coast of Perast in Montenegro, surrounded by the sparkling waters of the Bay of Kotor. 
The Benedictine Monastery, founded in the 12th century, is home to a small church and priory, as well as many beautiful cypress trees. Because it has been uninhabited for centuries and has long been used as a cemetery, it has earned the eerie moniker, the Island of the Dead. Although tourists are not permitted to visit, St. George Monastery is a beautiful sight to see while taking a boat trip around the Bay of Kotor, one of Montenegro's most beautiful natural attractions. Number 4. Katsky Pillar. Katsky Pillar is a natural limestone monolith that rises dramatically above its surroundings and houses the ruins of an early medieval hermitage. The sheer sides of the rocky outcrop tower to 40 meters in the west of Georgia. Its inaccessibility meant that its small church and hermit cells went unnoticed for centuries. The Pilar's ruins, long regarded as a symbol of the true cross by locals, were finally restored in the early 2000s when a monk moved in. Despite the fact that the site is closed to the public, Katsky Pillar is a breathtaking site, its prominent peak is surrounded by beautiful nature and stands out delightfully against the sky. Number 3. Tiger's Nest. The Tiger's Nest, perched perilously on a cliff face 900 meters above the Paro Valley floor, is one of Bataan's most sacred and spectacular sites. It was founded in 1692 around the cave where an important Buddhist master is said to have meditated, and it consists of four main temples. Aside from the beautiful architecture, the monastery is home to numerous meditation caves, statues, sculptures, and paintings. The complex is only accessible by climbing up stone steps and paths cut into the cliff face, as well as navigating the small rickety wooden bridges that connect them. From Paro Taktasang, you can enjoy breathtaking views of the valley and forest below while learning more about Bhutan's rich Buddhist history, culture, and heritage. Number 2. Tong Kalat. Tong Kalat, located atop a long extinct volcano, offers breathtaking views of Myanmar's Mandalay region and is a popular pilgrimage destination. The temple, which was built in the 19th century, is home to numerous gold stupas. The mount atop which it is perched is widely believed to be home to dozens of gnats, Myanmar-worshipped spirits. Visitors and pilgrims clamber barefoot up 777 steps to the summit of Mount Popa, dodging mischievous macaques along the way. Number 1. Meteora. Only second in importance to Mount Athos, the Meteora complex of Eastern Orthodox monasteries is one of Greece's most famous and photogenic sites. The 14th-century monasteries, built on top of massive rock columns that rise precipitously from the floor, provide commanding views of the plain of Thessaly. Meteora still has six operational monasteries, which house chapels, churches, and caves, as well as fantastic frescoes and ancient religious treasures. Visitors must hike up endless flights of stone steps cut into the rock to visit Meteora's majestic monasteries. These winding paths provide breathtaking views of the beautiful landscapes below. That's all. Don't forget to like and subscribe guys. It will help me a lot. See you in the next video.